for me, the, the mirror has always been a portal. A portal to deeper awareness about unjust incarceration. The wall of silence is a response to an open call from the New York City Mayor's Office that inspires activism about the criminalization of survivors of gender-based violence. You know, I believe that through a mirror, we are able to penetrate worlds that we've never experienced in our lives and then get other people to stand in front of it and then start to think about, well, who's being Who's being criminalized and why? Why are they behind bars? Why have they lost their freedom? Why are the rates of incarceration for people of color and trans people exponentially higher? How can we stop abusers from weaponizing the system? Why is incarceration the first response? So it's a way of going into the world of women and non-binary people and people of color who have never gotten a fair day in court and now are gone forever. They're forgotten. And there's a wall of silence around them. Let's disrupt the silence.